Greetings, you children at home. I hope you're not spooked right now because it's Halloween, because I'm gonna spook the shit out of you. Ha! <laughs> oh, no, wait, this is a terrible introduction. So, in three, two, one. So, hello, everybody, this is Psychedelic Eyeball, and welcome to this Castlevania 1 Let's Play Thread, a fine game by Konami, which was released in 1987, in which we're going to gleefully whip evil people, mummies, jellyfish, and bats in the face until they die. So, this is going to be promising, and a very good expedition, where everything will go wrong. So, let's load up the emula- uh, Oh, shit, what the hell is this error message? File header is unknown garbage data? That's weird. I run the emulator last night and the ROM was working okay. Okay, well, we're going to... Whoa! When the hell did Castlevania was black and white? This is a really old game, but come on, it's not that old! Oh, yeah, something really is wrong about this ROM. Okay, so there's no storyline or anything, so I figured that I should press the start key. Alright, so this is Simon Belmont. He's pantless and he's gonna get in line for getting killed by Dracula. And Oh, what is this? Is this a cutscene? Oh my god! I really thought that Ninja Gaiden was the first game which actually used cutscenes in NES games, but Castlevania 1 did it first, folks! So, this is Simon Belmont, and uh, why the hell does he ask pants now? Is, there's a lack of consistency here. Oh oh, the gate is closed. There's no choice but to go forward, my friend. Yeah, the music really is well made for NES game, but uh, where are the sound effects? I suppose this is a trade-off for the music chip or something. This must be the Japanese version, because the Japanese people always get the better music, the better extras. I hate those people, oh god. So yeah, is this Dracula or Frankenstein? No, he's the caporal and admiral of this boat and this castle. He's part of the army of darkness. Yeah, I guess it's Dracula, alright. You are late, young man. It is almost midnight. My servant have all retired. Oh, great. How the hell are we going to get a snack now? I really hate this place already. What a great case of inhospitality. Alright, come on, Simon Belmont. Take your whip and whip Dracula in the face for showing us such a bad welcome. Oh, uh, no, don't play the patience card. This is going to backfire against you. We're gonna have to go through six levels of bullshit. Here, you see? He already vanished. What an athletic old man. So, yeah, I suppose this is a statue of uh, Dracula whenever he was younger. I bowed out to you, my master. I have no possible hope of defeating you. I want to get out of here. I want to get out of here. Oh, come on. Bust open, you gang. Oh, God, I hate you. I hate you so much. <laughs> Alright, I've got no choice but to go forward with my crummy whip and this art, which supposedly makes me more powerful. Oh, I got a new whip. It's got a spiky ball, but it's not enough. Alright, I've got an even longer whip this time around. Yeah, I'm almost powerful now. Take that, evil snowman! Oh god, no! No, what have I done? No, I'm sorry, master. I'm, I'm sorry. Don't want to hurt you. Okay, I suppose it's just a statue. It's not going to come alive and attack me. Alright, I've got a knife. Oh god, this castle is so tall. Look at me, I can't even jump high enough. Oh my god, ah, I'm so scared. I, I can't think racially. Ah. <laughs> Alright, I figured I should go in. I can turn back anyway. Alright, stand here. All right. <laughs> I'm avoiding the entrance. Uh oh. Oh! Suddenly, this expedition for ransacking and pillaging this place has taken on a very interesting turn. Onward! Alright, there are many ghosts in this place, but they don't stand no chance against my new whip, so this is how it works around those parts. You get hearts in order to get love, and I show my love by thrusting knives in the face of my opponents! Uh, oh god, this panther nearly unbushed me. That's alright. He pays no time, because I'm Simon Belmont, and I've got holy water in my trade. BURN YOU FUCKER! Haha, <laughs> that's what you get. Oh, you again? Oh, now you're the ambush bastard. This is how I work around those cards. I ambush panthers like ambush ghosts on a stairway, while I'm waiting to climb on the second floor of this terrible mansion, filled with all sorts of horrible, disgusting stuff. Alright, so I've got this cross here, which kills everything. 
Long live the Holy Crusade. It has gave me many great tools for my trade. So I'm in this new room. Oh god, there's bats everywhere. Oh my god, there's bats here. Oh no, there's pork shops, which are probably made out of bat. But they're still yummy anyway. Mm, they make me feel stronger. I feel so strong now that I'm never going to be hit whatsoever. Just you watch. Oh god! Oh shit, alright, no, I've got a stopwatch, but come on, this is useless, I already know what time it is, give me a break, alright, oh, how did this appear, this, this money bag went out of nowhere whenever I kneeled down that platform, well, it is probably a sign from God that told me, Simon, what you're doing is right. You must pursue your crusade in order to get money, and in order to kill bats without even touching them with your whip. Because they're slimy, and you don't want to soil your whip. Alright, another court down. Oh god, no! Get away, you ghost, get away! Alright, now I've got some new holy water. I'm gonna drink it tonight and favor my bu- Ah, oh, shit, now I got an axe instead. That's okay, I'm still going to put it into good use. Oh my god, there's a gigantic bat up here. What I'm gonna do with it? Alright, this axe can pierce its defense, alright. Okay, take that, you Oh shit, no, I'm getting cornered in a star. Alright, throw faster, throw faster! Yes! I'm showing everybody how it's done. Alright, what the hell is this Orby thing? Well, uh, is it dangerous? Uh, yeah, it's probably a bomb or something. I should not touch it. I'm just going to go for further. Ah, no shit, this door is locked. Alright, come on, I've got to touch it. Here goes! Yes! Take that, you horb! Those orbs are very beneficial in my quest, it seems. So we're done with the first area of this gloomy castle. And the level comes to an end. And... Ah! Oh jeez, this cutscene cunt kicks in really suddenly. <laughs> this is some really weird design. Alright, now we're going through this door, but... Uh, why the hell are we in the, in the bedroom out of a sudden? This game has no consistency whatsoever, but then again, NES games aren't good for their stories. Oh shit, there's Dracula, he's waiting for us behind this door. Oh my god, oh my god, I don't like where this is going one bit. But, uh, yeah, there's really lack of consistency here. How come that Simon was currently whipping people with his whip and all this, and now he's got pants again, and now he's a fucking sissy. Oh my god. I really hate the story of this game. Uh, oh boy. Alright, this door opened for... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that he opened it telepathically. Oh, oh man. This is going to get ugly. Dracula is coming in to put an end to our ring of terror in this castle. We didn't even found a crucifix, holy water and magic sword. We're screwed! Alright, I better hide, I better hide! You're not coming to reach me, Dracula! Oh, oh no, come on! Stop! Stop, please! Oh, thank God, he really did stop. But, yeah. We're just done with the first level, and already Ca Dracula is waiting for us in the second level? What is this bullshit? I don't remember Castlevania being so hard. <sighs> yeah, this version really is a pain in the ass. Oh well. I figure that I should do whatever I can do to bring this boat alive. Because this is how it works around this part. So yeah, this is it for the first level of Castlevania. I hope you stick around, so see you everybody!